All right, so in this video, I have a pair of Air Jordan 3s that I'm really excited to show you guys. On the box, first of all, you can see that box. It's kind of an indication of what you're gonna get here. Really dope that they're doing like custom boxes per pairs like these. Uh, Air Jordan 3 Retro and White Light Curry Cardinal Red is the color, and I went true to size, which is what I like to do in this model. Boom, baby, we have the Cardinal Red Air Jordan 3s. These things are pretty crazy, man, so let's go ahead and get into the review. What is going on guys, Hess here. Hopefully you're having a good day out there. Thank you guys for stopping by and watching. If you guys are new to my channel, please consider subscribing. Collective Kicks in the description of the video. It's my website. I post a bunch of sneaker deals for you guys on a weekly basis. Big shout out to Hibbit Sports for sending this pair over to me. Wendy, Cena, everybody else over at Hibbit. Uh, you guys rock. I really do appreciate it. This is a colorway that I was very interested in. First images that we saw in December 2021. And Cardinal uh, Air Jordan 3s. Cardinal is something we've seen before. Uh, in the Air Jordan 7s, but not in an Air Jordan 3 form. It does kind of give fire red sort of vibes to it, but Cardinal Red definitely hits different when you get them in hand. Anyway, Hibbit Sports, if you haven't heard of them, it's an online retailer as well as a brick and mortar. They have over a thousand stores across the US and they have a really nice online presence now. If you haven't checked them out, link in the description. But check out their app as well. They have a release calendar that's always nice to see what releases are gonna be coming through uh, the pipes. But check out Hibbit Sports in the description of the video. But the Cardinal 3s definitely are something wild. It's not something that I've paid attention to every single release, but it feels like most of them don't have uh, just one singular color for top to bottom of the midsole and outsole. This split here from top to bottom we're used to seeing, but from left to right, usually part of it is like white. Anyways, you got tumbled leather on the upper of the shoe and then smooth leather around the trim of the toe guard. You have that elephant print that we know and love around the mud guard of the shoe as well as the heel collar. And on this one, they actually have the elephant underneath the laces which honestly just makes these things pop that much more. It just gives us a little extra elephant that makes these things like really, really nice. That light curry color can be seen on the tongue with the Jumpman embroidered, and then also the five circles down here uh, with the laces. You have a white perforated leather on the tongue as well as on the collar of the shoe. And then the collar is done in a nice like really soft material. It's almost like satin, but it's not, but it really is soft and, and nice and comfortable. Also the tongue is leather for those wondering. The outsole has the Jordan in Cardinal Red and then gray and white finish out the outsole. The midsole air unit is actually done in white, but the standout feature in these is definitely the red. It's definitely like a really shiny, glossy finish to the midsole, which honestly, I at first I was like, whoa, this is kind of crazy. But the more I look at them, I'm like, I, I really dig it. Like it just makes it that much more different than some of the other ones that we've seen. Uh, just the gloss factor. It's also glossy around the laces as well. And it feels like it's like super hard plastic or maybe even metallic. It's different than some of the other ones that we've seen where it's like a softer plastic. You have the Jumpman in air on the back, so no Nike Air, but it's not an original colorway. So acceptable that we have that, but that's done in a matte colored Cardinal Red. All in all, I think that these are a colorway that people are gonna be interested in. It's a really fun colorway. Definitely a nice colorway if you are a fan of the Cardinal Air Jordan 7s, uh, which is obviously kind of the, the loose theme that these ones were based off of. Anyways, I dig them. Thank you to Hibbit Sports again for sending mine over and be sure to check out Hibbit Sports if you guys are interested in buying a pair. They will have them available once they drop. Uh, but is this on your guys' radar? Is this something that you guys are gonna be picking up or not? Drop a comment and let me know. I think it's a really fresh new take on an Air Jordan 3. Some things that are obviously familiar, but some things that are uh, done in, in a really nice way, especially, I think my favorite part is the elephant print around the laces. I'm just not used to seeing that. And it, it makes it look like the way that all of them honestly should have probably came. I don't know, maybe some of you guys think it's too much elephant. I think that it's it just enough and it adds just enough back uh, to make these a little bit special. But uh, drop a comment, what do you guys think? And uh, appreciate y'all for stopping by and watching. Hopefully you guys have a good rest of the day and hit that subscribe button again if you guys are interested in my channel. Also, if you hit the like button, it's always appreciated as well. Uh, but uh, yeah, hopefully we'll see you back for some more videos. All right, peace guys.